I was invited to create Dancing in Pink Snow, a site-specific installation at Imstall, uh, a former horse stable in East Berlin's Prenzlauer Berg. Claiming the space, I did a lot of scraping to try to find the layer of the walls to kind of understand the space. Trying to figure out the pathways to travel through the room to create a series of platforms. Over a two-week period, I continually transformed the space. What you see here are different stages of completion. The space faced a residential stone courtyard. I extended the painting to all the surfaces, floors, walls, ceilings, and windows. I spent time watching a local dance class making drawings, which played out in the windows and wall markings. Uh, my approach involved painting and chiseling my drawings on the walls. Uh, these calligraphic line drawings sometimes came from tracking existing lines on the wall. I would constantly white out and then add new layers until I arrived at my final statement. Some of the painting was done in an invisible fluorescent paint seen only under black light. I mean, I, actually, this is now the closest to the idea that I wanted, which was about the layering of experience and movement. The lighting included both black and incandescent lighting on a timed program. A 16 millimeter film of people walking was projected onto the wall behind, or you could say in front of the swing and added to the layering of movement in the room. You look at the edges of the, of the camera, the right? moves, and yeah. you don't see it because I'm looking at the face right. of the people. So if you film somebody, it's more important to have him in the right position. This is cool. A key element was a red children's swing, which invited the viewer to experience the space in another way. For me, this activated the work, allowing the viewer to literally move within a three-dimensional painting. <laughs> 